Most people in life are looking for how do I make a life worth living in return with having. When I do these audio casts, there's always some person in a local shop who's a retail employee working at an hourly wage of possibly 10 to maybe at most $20 an hour who's interfering with my lawful rights to use the Wi-Fi to do what I need to do. But more importantly, they're interfering with my intellectual property rights on my videos. They're editing them. They're cutting them. They are destroying them and openly at some point the people that I work for is going to take them out of their house and take them out of their cars and take them to jail. You see cybercrime is a major concern for most professional people in the world. Anyone who runs a business, anyone who runs a practice, anyone who has an established corporation is concerned with identity theft and fraud on their company's name. We don't have the right to take people's logos because we can't explain how they were created today. We don't have the right to steal people's identities or pretend they have rights to make records on them. You see, those people go to jail today. The liar in the force is always a liar in the force. The bitch in a nursing unit is always the bitch in a nursing unit. When I make my recordings, I make them with the permission of someone so high that people don't believe it. They're like, how can you be homeless and work for that guy? That's the way it goes in life. In order to get yourself out of something, you have to present portfolio. And when you present portfolio that a president of the United States uses, then you get the message. But when you think that someone doesn't pay attention to a little guy, you're full of shit. They pay attention to everyone today. The people who come in from foreign lands and buy our cell phones, they can't take them back to their countries because they don't work there, motherfucker. So what that means is they automatically get placed in the Skynet. And in the Skynet, they review the text messages, they review everything about you, and eventually, they take you for your Stupidville. Your Stupidville is thinking that no one's paying attention to your life that doesn't know you. That's not true. Whenever I go places, people piss all over me because some girl lied in a report. And when she lied, she took away rights. And when she got other people to lie too, she took away more rights. And we have human rights in this world. We actually led the world in the concepts of human rights.